activation of the leader's heart. For me, it's, the heart is the key for everything. And we did the other webinars also building up the systems. For me, a really pure leader and powerful leader is one who's open to drop into one's heart, into one's vulnerability, because that is the strength. The vulnerability is the strength. So, and also for manifestation, to go into the quantum field, it's about feeling it in your heart space and then feeling it in the field around us and then we draw it to us. So the visionary, the dreamer in the heart, the leader of the heart. So what blocks that? What is in the way of that? Grief, for example, heartache, heartbreak, ancestral grief. Um, so in this webinar, and it's a teaching webinar because when you do it yourself, then you're going to be able to activate others, leaders and around you. Because I really feel it's about activating the leaders at the moment around us. And we're all doing that in our own unique way. So by being you in it, it doesn't mean you need to do this work. It simply will activate in you. And then you have that resonance for all around you as well. And it goes out to the universe and back. So to really drop, drop, drop into your heart space, you need to work through all the systems that are blocking it and from receiving it. And it was interesting. I'm you know, just sitting in these, this chair at the moment, and it's from the Congo. And it was the king and the queen's chair. Uh, they made them. They're made with thousands of beads. And while I was working just before, it was like I could feel the energy of the king come in and then the energy of the king and I felt the king's advisor come in. And when I was meditating, I, I felt the energy on the spirit of the one who, who was advising and guiding the king. And for me, that is key that you can be the king and be open to receiving information and reading information and then feeling it in the filter of the heart because the king has to be careful what he's been told. He has to check it in his heart. The queen has to check it in our heart space. So for me, the, the filter is the heart. And if you're not fully in your heart, if you've got conditional expectations, judgments in the system, and you're not willing to look at one's shadow, what's in the heart space, then you're going to miss things and greed will come in. And we have great examples of destructive leaders in the world at the moment who have weak hearts because there's a lot of wounds in the heart that hasn't been addressed. So for me, being a great leader is the ability to drop into one's heart space and to drop into one's heart space for me, it took years. And I remember when I first did it, it was like I could just, just drop in there for a few minutes because a lot of pain was there. So that is different now because what I'm sharing with you are the keys of the heart, the keys of transforming the pain, which is in the ancestral's heart and your own. And then you will be able to activate that within your own life system, but also, as I say, inspire others to activate it in them. So these four webinars are going to go in like a microscope into the heart space and see what is there, what is ready to be transformed, what wants to be revealed and what is blocking you. The benefits I feel coming to you if you do this webinar is that you'll be more open to receiving love more open to accepting your qualities, more open to accepting that creator, leader, inspirational child with your gifts and bring it into the world, valuing them. For me, the value is very important. The, the key is to honor your own truth, your own frequency. And this will then manifest in your lives so I feel many, many benefits coming through this webinar. And as you know, for anyone who's done the, the other webinars, I talk about what's coming in, the, the keys come in, but then a lot more comes in through the webinar once the field is open. So I'm really excited to, to see, I'm curious to see what other keys come in 
because we're, as more people come in and share, you know, coming to the group field, that you're also sharing your keys with the group because the heart space and the leader is unconditional and is very generous and sharing of the heart in, in opening up these qualities. So this webinar will be four webinars going very, very deep into activating, seeing what's in your system first, clearing it, transforming it, and then building it up. And I can feel really your heart vessel will become stronger, wider, more whole, more wise, because we're going to do a lot of activations. And I can feel a lot of king activation, queen activations in here coming in and great leaders coming in. So I'll be working with the archetypes. And since I arrived in Africa, I feel a lot more archetypes of the African leaders, kings coming into the system too. And what's so beautiful about, I feel about here, what I've experienced myself is the deep connection with the wisdom of the forest, of nature, of the animal kingdom, and of the fields that we are not maybe able to read and not able to manifest in. So I feel a lot of power coming into the system, which will open up your own potential, your own power of the heart. And whatever keys come in, once they drop into the heart space, it's pure, it's clean. So I really feel there's a lot of abundance coming in this webinar. And I invite you, if you're not part of the leadership team, <laughs> I invite you to, to take that leap of fate and to enter the leadership group. And you will be inspired. And the more time you spend in this vessel, I guarantee your life will change. You will not come out the same person because it's going to stretch you, it's going to activate you, it's going to transform what's in the way, and it's going to set you free. And it was interesting, when I was meditating this morning, was very strong, and it came in very strong, was when I said the, you know, the king's advisor came in, and what came true was this very strong, powerful spirit, and he said to me, he says, you know, I mean, we know what it's like to be slaves, and we know how to be free of it. And I feel that is the key, which is really the key for transforming all of us in this world at the moment, to be free of all slavery, which has been indoctrinated or manipulated in our systems. So I invite you to be free and you can create your own art, your own dance, your own music, your own inspiration, and manifest your divine essence and manifest it within this life and leave that legacy behind. So I invite you to be part of this webinar. And we'll do this together and unite. you all and thank you all for your support over the years and for all the keys and gifts you've brought in to be here because we all chose to be here at this time and place and it's really time to step into ourselves our being and step out of all this programming so i invite you to activate your heart thank you <laughs>